Tom Roofer and welcome to Getting to Know Us. This is the first in a series of videos with the intention of showing all of us what goes on behind the scenes in some other departments across our enterprise. Today we're going to start with nutrition services at the main Lake Region campus. So let's go take a look. So like most departments, we started off the day with a huddle where Christy brought us all up to speed on the menu and the game plan. Next, it was over to the bakery with Jody, where she showed me how she bakes buns fresh every day. Next up, it was time to make the sandwiches. It turns out that peeling bits of turkey apart is not quite as easy as it looks. After making an attempt to wrap some sandwiches, I decided to take my turn over at the scooping station. Here I helped craft some tasty looking sandwiches. Then it was time to get them all packaged up and bring them out to the display case to become part of someone's delicious lunch. It's a bit of an art form to get everything stacked nicely in there and looking presentable. Then it was time for me to try my hand at serving some of the delicious creations from the kitchen. That also is nowhere near as easy as it looks. You have to be very careful about what utensils and tools that you have touched and make sure that you are following strict food safety requirements at all times while providing great customer service. After quick stops at the coffee station and trying out the cash register, it was time to go back and make some salads. This locally grown hydroponic lettuce is one of the many delicious vegetables that makes it into our salads here at Lake Region Healthcare. It takes quite a bit of time and care to put the salads together in an appetizing way that helps them fly off the shelves. Next up, it was over to the kitchen and to the tray line. So the way it works is that the food is made in the kitchen area here uh, where they've got deep fryers and ovens and microwaves. Uh, and then so you can see right now, we've got Missy, she's, uh, she's cooking, she's doing all sorts of things at once. And we've got a label printer over here and, a, and so when, when orders are entered into the system, they go from the computer to the label printer that prints out the label to tell Missy what she needs to make. And then, here to the tray line and that's um, for you know patients that are ordering trays or um, or the occasional staff tray that comes here. and then there's an assembly line back here where they put that all together it goes on the cart when they put the first thing in the cart they start a timer for 10 minutes and then at the end of that 10 minutes they have to take that cart up it's got to go up and get delivered so it's, everything is moving right along especially during the meal times uh, moving pretty quick in a normal year, dietary services would be preparing hundreds of catered meals for internal meetings and events, and I got the rare opportunity to watch Janet use her skills to lay out a beautiful spread for an important meeting. And what would a day in the kitchen be without doing some dishes? As a good steward of our resources, they are able to use technology where water is recirculated for rinsing and washing the dishes, doing a sterile rinse with fresh water at the end. Next, the dishes are hung up on racks to dry, where they wait being used in the creation of another delicious meal. So Nutrition Services has uh, different areas that we cover. Um, of course, the patient food service. And we keep in mind that not only do we eat because we get hungry or it tastes good, um, but from our perspective, the food is part of their healing. and. Um, eating the right foods can help the patients heal, it can help to give them um, strength, you know, hydration and the right nutrients. Um, getting enough of the right nutrients can help with certain disease states and getting um, not too much of some nutrients helps with other disease states. So we keep that in mind too. Um, all our people are trained in food safety and sanitation and that's a big part of what we do. Um, whenever I interview somebody, we tell them, you know, here's the here's the main part of the job, you know, dishwashing or working on tray line or whatever. Um, and then there's a whole lot of cleaning that goes along with it. So um, keeping things safe and clean and sanitary is a big part of what we do. Um, the catering, like you mentioned in other parts of the video, uh, has gone down recently. Uh, we still do a little bit. Um, the catering is all in-house uh, for the most part. Uh, the other uh, big part of what we do is dietitian services. So we have, um, we have three full-time dietitians and one casual and our dietitian services are involved in outpatients and um, we have two that work in the outpatient setting with diabetes education and we're hoping to start um, somewhat of a new service line in wound care. We're going to find out soon 
um, how that'll go. Uh, hopefully that's a, um, a new area that we can dive into. Uh, we do a little bit at the cancer center with those patients and we do uh, inpatients. And so nutrition care, diabetes care, um, through learning about what foods to eat, how do they help with healing and, uh, and that kind of thing. So uh, I think I think I hit them all. <laughs> oh, and the cafeteria, of course. Everybody's familiar with the cafeteria. So I'm super proud of the job that everybody in this department does. They are very caring. They're very smart, um, responsible, and everything you'd want in a in a team of people. And yeah, I love them. I love this department. Love working here. And there you have it. So remember. You're gonna see me show up in your department at some point, so be ready to show off what you do and what you're proud of. And thanks again for all of your hard work.